guy and he tells me that he still deals with pain inside of his cranium like every day he can feel pain no I promise you I'm being a hundred percent serious like verbatim he told me this and um so yeah um also on the fucking stream last night when he was like talking about the respect thing I could I could pull it up right now matter of fact and I can explain what I was saying literally nothing nothing bad at all this is getting interesting y'all fucking weirdo dude like I was like I've never seen anything fucking like this like it's it's very sad but just gotta fucking hope and pray you know someone needs to see this Someone needs to reach out to his parents. Something I I truly hope I truly hope he gets the help he needs and he really needs it. Okay, so let me get the screen capture going. Okay. Um, hold on, let me turn this off. Okay. Let me know if y'all can hear the video. Can y'all hear it? Let me um rewind a little bit. Can y'all hear the video? Oh yeah, dude. I fucking think that would have been fucking Check DMs. Check DMs. Uh, you're talking about Discord? Okay. I'll check them real quick. <laughs> You got the clip? Okay, I feel you. Alright, one second guys. I got a lot of people hitting me up. People want to know the truth. We've been waiting. We've been waiting. Okay. Okay, yeah, yeah, loser. I'm I'm um I'm gonna pull that one up too. But for now I'll show you um show you guys this clip. And I'll explain what was going on uh, when he turned off the stream and everything. Uh, one second, boys. Okay, let me uh, put this in theater mode or some shit. Okay, there we go. All right. Dude, I'll tell you what, this company right here hates my ass. Damn, I don't know why I can't hear it. I know um, it. Okay, it's I can hear it over here. It's fucked up. Not sure why. Talk about it. Uh, here. Yeah, cook his ass. Oh, he's still amazing. We got him. Literally chilling there, doing I don't know nothing. Why I stand like you that. Okay. Oh, he knew that. Okay. So you gonna put the nail on? Yep. Yep. Oh, come on. It's safe stuff. This is really no safing, is there? Remember back in the day, guys, when people respect you? No. No, respect. You gotta be fucking kidding me. It's safing. So. What do you know about that? He was, um, he was talking about safing. Like, the dude ate. Safing is called when people eat to the full health or whatever. Like, it's kind of like a disrespectful thing in RuneScape. And I told him, I was like, they don't have the respect anymore like like they used to. And he was like, you can hear it. Hold up. Let me turn it up a little bit. He was like talking like, oh, what do you know about respect? You've been disrespecting me since you got here. All types of shit. Here we go. Here we go. Nothing. You don't know shit. You think you're taking over. You got to be fucking kidding me. Yeah, right. Is that your plan all along? I'll roast the fuck out of you, boss man. You want to go, buddy? You want to go? Respect. That's the last thing you know about. Hello? Are you, did you not know how to talk? Hello? Are you there? No, I respect. Are you there? Are you there? Are you there? It's okay, bro. I guess so. Yeah, dude. You definitely started this. So at this point, he keeps talking, trying to antagonize me. I'm keeping my cool, just... You know, because I know anything I say, it's going to provoke him and agitate him way further. I'm being the adult in this situation and keeping my mouth shut because, you know, I know his panties are in a bunch. 
I don't know what's really going through his head because I've never done those magic rocks before. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Um, and he's also, he told me he got a bunch of like mental disorders, you know, whatever. I think most of it's stemming from the lack of sleep and the magic rocks. But um, let's keep watching. Let's keep watching. This boss man. I'm letting you chill in my house. And you're talking about me disrespecting you? I'll knock your bitch ass out. Don't fuck it. Do not do that. Do not do that. Do not do that, boss man. I didn't mean it like that. Fuck him. He'll be fucking kidding me. He said I was talking about me disrespecting him. Like, <laughs> are you hearing shit still? Like, what's going on? Austin, are you there? Are you there, buddy? What's going on? Are you there? Or are you, are you Jekyll or are you Hyde today? What's going on? Are you there? Knock, knock. Are you there, Austin? Keep watching. Keep watching, y'all. This is just the beginning. Y'all have no fucking clue what happened off stream. Like, when he told me to get the fuck out, like, Oh, all right, we'll get into that in a little bit, but let's keep this shit rolling. I'll kick you out right now, boss. I better delete the VOD, huh? It was just part of the... It's not a real thing, guys. This guy's dead. Please don't. Oh, he's... A, God, he's safe, bro. Dr. Options with the goddamn pack. Let's go, baby. Thank you about six pack, my boy. You a goddamn beast, bro. Love you, bro. Thank you. You're so kind to me. Respect me. Shit. Oh, good fight, dude. Poor Justin. No, dude, fuck you, Mixie. You're a fucking hater rat. He knows exactly what he's doing and what he's been doing. No moss, my boy. No moss. I let you have your fun for a little bit. Good luck. You know what I'm saying? Good fucking luck. So, people in his chat, even his fucking day ones or whatever, they're like, oh, poor Justin, like, you know, sticking up for me. And the only ones that were sticking up for him are his fucking pussy fucking cocksucking motherfuckers that ride his dick and don't have a fucking mind of their own. They only say shit to appease him. They're scared of talking in his chat because they know they're going to get fucking permanently banned, instantly banned. Oh, get in the bin, you know, fucking pussy. And whenever he, y'all see with Yasuo, he was on a fucking call with him. He didn't let him talk at all. He was screaming over him like... He doesn't let anyone speak their fucking mind. It's literally his way or the fucking highway, and I feel like that's that's fucking wrong, you know. But um, anyways, he he pretty much said I was using him the whole time. I was using him for his clout. Y'all, don't you think if I brought my whole setup, don't you think right when I got there, I would go ahead and start the stream with him so we have both of ours to get you know follows and shit and try to steal clout if if that's what he thought I was doing. The whole time I never set up my PC and the only time I streamed when I was over there was when he offered for me to do the fishing stream. So yeah, um, let's keep playing. Just say I've been doing nothing, right? Good. Good. He started this. Dude, he's been trying to take over. Been, dude, he'll be if I hadn't like, done anything, he like would you just say Does anybody that I'm not doing anything. Bruh. <laughs> make it make sense. Obviously, I'm being quiet because you're a fucking retard and you got like a, a fuse like the size of your fucking penis. Fucking weirdo. Y'all all know I was fucking being quiet. Cause I didn't want him to fucking like kill himself or some shit. This dude is so unhinged. Like, this dude needs serious help. And I hope, I really hope that his sponsors don't continue to work with him because it literally is just fueling his addiction. And I'm not talking about the gambling. The gambling is like so minuscule on, in like a, a part of his life. Like, yeah, he streams because, you know, he makes more money and shit. But literally, it's a cycle. All he does is lose money. He uses some of it to get those magic rocks. It's a complete cycle. And, um, yeah, in my opinion, he only cares about the fucking, the magic rocks. Like, when I was over there, he was, he was winning like six cents, seven cents on fucking BC game and steak. And his reactions were legit. The same reactions when he fucking won the 70,000. Like, Pretty much the same dopamine high he gets from a six cents hit. It's the same shit he gets from a seventy thousand dollar hit. Like, 
I literally saw no difference, and I was just sitting there quiet, like, you know, obviously, I'm not going to celebrate six cents, seven cents win, like, you know, like him, I'm just, like, sitting there, I'm like, um, okay, I guess, you know, weird flex, but okay, I guess, but, um, all right, let's keep it going, let's keep it going. I know what I'm talking about, it's fine if you don't, dude. Yeah, that's what he's good at, making me look like the bad guy. Good job, Justin. Good job, bro. Hold up, guys. You're doing it all to yourself, just like you always do. You self-destruct. And the only people that try to help you, you cut out of your life eventually. Most times more rapid than others. I've seen it before. We've all seen it. Y'all know what I'm talking about. And yeah. Um, it, it's very sad. And I, I truly hope he gets the fucking help he needs. Because this dude is... He doesn't have a, a long future ahead of him. If this is the road that he's going to continue to travel on. Just saying. I'm not wishing anything bad upon him. But I do hope that his mom sees this eventually i met her she was sweet she was nice but she's like way too nice i feel like the only reason why he's still there is because of her i feel like she's scared to kick him out because he might die out there on the streets he might become homeless he might you know start carjacking again and and get hit in the back of the head with a big rock you know he's 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 like an animal like but he's just at the crib Luckily, he doesn't have a car. He probably would have killed someone by now, um, driving while intoxicated with um, the magic rocks. But um, but yeah, let's um, let's keep this shit going. So at this point, at this point of the video of the stream, he's like, "What are you doing, bro? Like, quit trying to steal. I know what you're doing. Get the fuck out." Like he was literally trying to kick me out right now at this point, after like he turned off the fucking screen. He was trying to kick me, kick me out, and I was, like, trying to calm him down like I've literally been doing ever since I got there, and I calmed him down, and I was like, bro, you're misinterpreting it. I didn't say that, you know, whoop-de-whoop. -whoop. I was telling him the truth, you know, and, um, and yeah, he just, he was like, okay, um, you know, I'm sorry. Like, he did apologize this time, but he was still being a fucking dick, but, um, yeah, he apologized because he knew he was in the wrong. Respect on RuneScape, is that right? It's a safe thing to do. Right. That's what I was talking about. Keep watching, wait for it. He apologizes and shit this time. Alright, let me skip ahead a little bit. I'm back, guys. What's up, guys? How we doing? We all good? I apologize to him. You know, whatever. I could have been misinterpreting shit. I definitely could have. But we're all good. We're, we're married now. We're freaking chilling. Oh, boy. You know, we've been around each other a little bit. You know, At this point, um... Wait, well, hold on. Let me, let me, let me play that last one out, because, um... Because that's crucial. That last little bit out. He said we butt heads and shit. But literally, it's just him. It's a one-way fucking street. Listen to this shit. I'm back, guys. What's up, guys? How we doing? Hey, Allison, what's up? You you in a fucking real man's fucking chat now. Say bye to the fucking bitch you fucking had before. Fuck that motherfucker. That dude's worse than a fucking... I don't know. I don't even want to talk about it because he's like at the bottom of the fucking barrel. You could do better. You could do better. Trust me. Believe it. You definitely can do better. I've never seen you, but it doesn't matter what you look like. You could do better, young lady. Okay. 
We all good. I apologize to him. You know, whatever. I could have been misinterpreting shit. I definitely could have. But we're all good. We're, we're made it down. We're freaking chilling. Oh, boy. You know, we've been around each other a little bit. You know, butt heads sometimes, whatever. It happens, dude. You know, I apologize to him. So we're all chilling. Okay, we're going to try one more time, guys. One more time on this motherfucker. Nothing, dude. Nothing. He said we butt heads sometimes. But literally, y'all have all seen this all on stream. When he was going crazy telling me to kick kick me out and shit, I was like, okay, you know, I'll go home. Like, I was literally planning to go home very soon anyways. I just, you know, it was like a weird fucking vibe. Like, and I'm, I didn't like sleeping over there. I didn't really feel safe. Like, you know, at any point with his hallucinations and his magic candy or whatever, uh, I was just like, it wasn't great sleep, you know. But I know he didn't sleep at all. Like, so at least I slept better than him. I was like, sheesh. Okay. Nothing. Let's keep it going. Not worth talking about anymore. Discord. What do you mean? Oh. Oh, I see. Okay. All right. Let me uh, maybe fast forward. I went in the other room so he could, you know, cool down a little bit. Fast forwarding. Go to monkeyshead.com and turn your username on. Picture of me, or video of Let's me, see what he's talking about playing me. on BC game. It is completely fabricated. It cannot be real. Oh, he's talking they about that. Fucking, shared it in my Discord. He almost lost his sponsorship. He's sharing my stream, streaming in my Discord or something with BC game on there, which is not true. So if you guys could just vouch for me that that has not happened. Who in my stream right now has been in my Discord for at least a week and knows? Vouch for me, guys. Vouch for me. I did not play on BC Games. Please don't do it, Steak. I can't buy my magic candy. You better not take it away. I'm telling you, you better not. Something bad's going to happen and I'm going to hit myself in the head again or hit my dad. You better not fucking do it, you bitches. Fuck. Let me smoke this shit again. God damn it. Motherfuckers. Ah, fuck. Posted, I've not posted anything like that or shared my stream or anything like that with... B Guys, I'm gonna do re something really fucking stupid. Oh my god, someone fucking juice me. <laughs> game. Please just fucking vouch for me. That has not happened. It's never happened. I would never do that. That would never... I would never do that. Okay. Yes, please. Yeah. Everyone knows, man. What do you mean, dude? Okay, I thought you were gonna be sarcastic. I would never do anything like that. I wouldn't. I would, I, dude. I wouldn't. I wouldn't do that. So. Okay, good. Thank you, Am. Thank you. Hey, guys, can you please vouch for me that I have not shared anything related to BC Game? Um, okay. Related to BC Game, such as a photo or a video or a stream. Please, if you've been in this gift course, please just vouch that I've only played on stage. Oh man. How did the room smell? Oh, <laughs> y'all don't want to know. Hey, y'all see that fucking, while we're, while we're talking about the room, y'all see that big ass black trash bag right behind him? Yeah, I filled that bitch up by myself because I couldn't stand looking at all the trash on the ground. I literally was like, this is going to take, it might take a couple days, but uh, you know, we could at least get started. He made me do that shit all by myself. I was picking up all his fucking shit. He had mold on some fucking paper plates, old food. He had fucking baking soda on the ground everywhere in the carpets. It was burned. There was hairs everywhere. It looked like a fucking horror scene, a horror show. Oh my fucking goodness. Like, y'all only can see a little bit from the camera. If he turned that motherfucker around, y'all would... Um, <laughs> Oh shit, I could not stand to look at that shit.
Nah, I was not barefoot. I definitely had some socks on, my G. I damn sure had some socks on. Gotta get that double protection. Had I might have had double fucking socks on, honestly. Fuck that shit. But um, okay, let's keep going. Let's keep yeah, going. I need that. Yeah, I can't do that. I would never do that. I'm getting fourteen thousand dollars a week, dude. I'm fucking chilling. I'm good. I don't want that. I don't want anything to do. With that. I would never do that to mess up my deal. I mean, and then everyone knows. Everyone that's in my Discord knows that that's true. So. Mm -hmm. I never did that. Yes, thank you, thank you. You're a real one. You're a real one. You're a real one, bro. Thank you. This is at this time people are like fucking spamming in his Discord. Oh, he doesn't play for BC games. And I was saying the same shit, always having his back. Um let me um fast forward a little bit. Let me fast forward. Maybe it's Why here. would I do that? Okay. Tell me one reason why I would do that. Why? Why would I do that? Why would I do that? Tell me the reason why. What would why would I do what would be the reason for me to do that? Tell me. That's what I thought. That's what the fuck I thought. That's what the fuck I thought, dude. I have nothing to hide, dude. I mean, dude, tell me, tell me this. I can ask the whole Discord again. Y'all, do y'all realize whenever someone just keeps talking about st stuff on like repeating it over and over, they're guilty. They're guilty as fuck. And that's all Boss Man does. He's always trying to boost his head up. He was always telling me, oh, I feel so insecure. I doubt myself. I was always. Trying to tell him, like, oh, you a beast, bro, you know, like, trying to help him out any way he could, you know, like, he was just so insecure, and, you know, he, he talks that talk, but fucking bullshit walks, and that motherfucker, that motherfucker bullshitter, straight up bullshitter the whole time I was there, fucking magic rock king, I should say, magic rock fucking king. <laughs> the whole Discord would, dude, the whole Discord would know, try, don't try to tell me. People wouldn't take videos and screenshots if I was really playing on BC in my Discord. Okay. Y'all are talking about, um... Okay. Let me take a little break from the video. Let me take a little break. And I will tell y'all more about that shit. Ooh. Okay, okay. Y'all, this shit's funny. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we fucking go, boys. I bet. All right, you see how my room is? You see how I like to keep it pretty clean? You know, like, it's not perfect, but it damn sure ain't like that. You know what I mean? That shit, I, I've never seen anything fucking like it. Never seen anything like that shit. It was like out of a fucking horror movie. Okay. Now let's talk about him. Okay. All right. So pretty much, um... He um he had me get off the stream or whatever. I gave him some space to relax, whatever. And then he finally tells me to come back in, and he wanted me to get on stream talking about BC game and and how he doesn't stream it or play it or whatever. And I literally came on and I was like, he does not. I, ever since I've been here, he I have not seen him play BC game. He's like, what the fuck you say? You fucking rat! Get the fuck out! Get the fuck out! I'm like. Wait, is this for real? Like, did I say something bad? Like, um, you good, bro? What did you hear? Did you hear something else? Like, are you okay, bro? Can I get you some water? Can I give you a hug? Um, you know, we could talk about it. I'm like, nah, it's okay. I'll leave. I'll leave, bro. I'll leave. But don't touch me. Because you will get fucked up. Fuck the fuck up. <laughs> Alright, so... He pretty much like, when he turned off the stream, he was like, oh, I know you've been recording me on BC Game. You're trying to fucking sabotage me. You don't want me to be with steak. And I told him like legit 30 to 50 times. I swear I've never been recording inside. I insist as best as I can that I'm not. And he still does not believe me. And probably for the whole fucking time I was there, he didn't believe anything I said because he was probably hallucinating the whole time. 
He was up on like fucking benders, bro. Like three, four, five days straight. I'm like, does this dude ever have time to sleep? You gotta fit it in your schedule, my boy. We need to get you a fucking calendar or some shit. Fit that motherfucker in your schedule. You need some sleep. But yeah, I kept trying to convince him that I was not recording. I've never recorded. I told him if I was actually a rat. I would have fucking jugged his um, gold and silver a long time ago. He leaves that shit right on his computer desk. Like, I could have easily grabbed it if I wanted to. But I wasn't trying to. I don't do that shit. But, um, but yeah. I kept trying to convince him. He's he's just, like, beyond paranoid. And, um, yeah. And let me, um, okay. Yeah, okay, here we go, here we go. He said, y'all heard it. We butt heads sometimes, and um, when in reality, he's literally the only one that gets angry or spazzes out. And then we talk about him kicking me out, and he tried to kick me out before I could get my wallet, my toothbrush, and everything like that. Mind you, he does not own a toothbrush. He does not own a toothbrush. And the whole time I was there, he didn't shower once. I kept telling him, like, bro, you're going to feel a lot better. Just hop in the shower, bro. It's a quick one, you know, get some soap on you, get some cold water if you need it. I promise you, you'll feel better. He was like, yeah, okay, okay, I will, I will. And then he always, he's so scatterbrained, he'll be like, okay, I will. And then he's like, okay, I'm going to start up the stream. I'm like, okay, um, didn't you want to shower first? Like, you sure? And then he won't even start up the stream. He'll hit up his dude that you saw the text. Um, you know what I'm talking about, the magic rock guy. <laughs> Um, yeah, he'll fucking go over there and be like, yo, bro, please pull up, please, bro, bro, pay me what you owe me, that dude's saying, he's like, bro, I get paid tomorrow, bro, it hasn't come in, I get paid, I got you, you still got my silver bar, he doesn't give a fuck about the silver bars, he only cares about the magic rocks, he doesn't really care about the gambling either, maybe a little bit, but the magic rocks, like, it's like, his eyes are like this. The magic rocks just like, whoa, magic rocks, baby, magic fucking rocks. Yeah, he's a fucking animal. Animal. But yeah, he didn't shower the whole time. I was fucking there. Smelled like a motherfucker. This dude was like smoking his magic rocks in my car when I'm driving and shit. I'm like, God dang, bro. Like, you know, I'd be like keeping my shit clean. I don't want that shit in there. So like. Whenever he does, I roll down all the windows. I hold my breath so I don't got to breathe that shit in. You know, I turn the AC up all the way so it blows out, you know. Like, hopefully it doesn't get stuck to the leather seats. But, um, it's very unfortunate. When he's got to have it, he's got to have it, I guess. He really needs some help. Bad. Um, and I hope Steak and his mom can realize it. He needs a, a big breather from getting money coming in because it, you know what it goes to? either goes to the loans that he pays like 30% interest on, 20% interest, whatever. He gets scammed by his so-called friends that loan him, but they're making like three to 500 off him every week. Oh, let me hold on to 100 until I get my paycheck. Please, bro. Please, bro. I'm fiending. I want to gamble. I want to gamble. Come on, bro. Please. I got you. I got you on Wednesday, bro. I get paid. My paycheck's on Wednesday, bro. Don't worry. I got you. But probably most of the time, he'll be like, oh, it's for gambling. Nah, bruh. Y'all really think it's for gambling? Magic rock time, baby. Magic fucking rock. <laughs> but yeah, this dude is a fucking... He's one of a kind, truly. You know, he's he's definitely one of a kind. Uh, it kind of is what it is. Um, but yeah. Um, he was kicking me out, and... Um, he was literally trying to insist that he'll ship me my, like, wallet and shit. I'm like, nah, bro, I ain't leaving shit without my shit. Like, I'll go, but I need all my shit. And he's, like, following me, like, like this is what he's doing. He's, like, like walking behind me. What are you, what are you doing? What are you doing? Are you taking shit? Are you taking shit? What are you doing? Hurry up and leave. Hurry up and leave. Go. Like, bro, this small fucker is so unhinged. He was like walking behind me like, like, where, where are you looking? Like, what are you doing? Hurry up, get the fuck out. And like, bruh, I swear it took so much strength 
for me not to light this motherfucker up, bro. Like, <laughs> one punch to the fucking gut. Y'all hurt his lungs. Y'all heard him coughing. That motherfucker's down. Or even one chokehold, anything. Done. But I'm not a fighter, you know. I definitely protect myself and shit. I'm, I'm not a fighter, as y'all could see. I kept my mouth shut. But that motherfucker would get the work. And honestly, I kind of wish he tried to do something on stream. Just so there's proof that he attacked first. And then I could get a free knockout. You know what I'm saying? And then I'd be, I'd probably grab my shit. Call the cops, whatever. I don't know. And I'd, I'd get my shit and be like, Uh, Mr. and Miss Peterson, uh, you might want to check on your little boy. Um, 30-year-old boy. But yeah, he's over there. He might need some help. He might, see, might need some assistance. You know what I'm talking about? He's down on the floor. Um, so, um, yeah. He was insisting on, like, shipping my shit to my crib. I'm like, hell nah, bro. I ain't leaving. Um, I'll mail your stuff to you, which, of course, I knew that was never going to happen. His parents finally came out of the room after he was yelling for, like, I'm talking, like, it felt like 10 minutes, but it was probably, like, I don't know, maybe three minutes or some shit. I don't know. It was kind of.